Just like the illegal mining in Goa and Karnataka, a 16,000 crore illegal granite scam is rocking Tamil Nadu. On the run is the Union Minister M.K. Aragiri's son, Durai Dayanidhi. And the Tamil Nadu government has now launched a crackdown on over 100 granite companies. Sam Daniel reports. A huge embarrassment for the DMK. The son of M.K. Aragiri, a Union Minister, on the run. And now, a lookout circular has been issued to stop him from leaving the country. Madurai police say the company owned by Durai Dayanadi had illegally mined granite and stole huge quantities from an adjoining government quarry as well. An FIR has been registered against Durai Dayanadi under the Mines and Minerals Act and he has sought anticipated bail. Now the accusation is that uh, they have uh, not done quarrying in their Patta land, instead they have done uh, quarrying in the Tamin uh, area, which is a Porumbok land, which is a government land basically. Sources close to Durai Alaguri say he owned that company when his grandfather Karunanadi was the chief minister and gave it up when the DMK lost elections. The Madurai District Administration is cracking the whip on 175 granite quarries. This after a former collector estimated a loss of 16,000 crore due to rampant violations and collusion with officials. 46 people including a leading exporter Pia Palaliswamy and three officials are behind bars. A detailed survey is on to assess the value of granite mined over the years. With camera person Edwin in Chennai, Sam Daniel, Find the TV. India's number one news app just got even better. Download NDTV's new app, fully optimized for Retina display, full screen view, faster response time, and Sudoku. NDTV's new iPad app. Download now.